Hello, welcome to another episode on White Davy Gardening and Worm Farm. Here I went out and got myself some tulip bulbs that I'm going to be planting. As I'm told that fall is the best time to plant them. I've never really grown tulips before. So I'm going to be planting some on the front of the property although it doesn't do well on the front to plant anything because of the government trees that are constantly blocking up my sunlight so this here it, it has no you can't that's dirty it has 30 bulbs in it So I'm going to be planting some of them on the front and the rest I'm going to be planting at some point in one corner of my garden. So in this area here I am going to be planting my tulips but it requires loose well-drained soil as you can see this is not necessarily loose soil it falls apart readily but it is not loose enough it is the soil here has quite a lot of worms in it I'm going to be taking out some of the soil and I'm going to be adding a bit of compost to the to this section so I am adding the compost I'm going to be mixing it in I went ahead and took out all of the grass root that I saw so I'm gonna get this bed ready and then tomorrow I will plant those tulips it's a bit noisy because my neighbors dogs just keep going but I'm about to start planting the tulips so you want to plant them with the pointy part up it can be planted in Sun or partial shade and you want to plant them four to six inches deep I'm going to be putting these four inches deep and then I'm going to be covering them with two inches of mulch and you want to plant them four inches apart fall is the best time to plant tulips but if you cannot plant them in fall then you want to store them in a cool dry dark area over the winter and tulips like loose well-drained soil I want this entire stretch here all the way down to be just tulips. Thank you. 
that's all the instruction on the package say that it is to be watered thoroughly after planting but as you can see I watered my bed before I planted the tulips I'm going to go ahead and give it another water now and the reason I watered it before is because I just revitalized this bed with some finished compost and it is pretty dry and it doesn't absorb water that well initially the water just settles on the surface so in order to ensure that the bed is thoroughly watered after planting I watered it and then I mixed the soil up in the water just to make sure that it is thoroughly soaked before planting the tulips so now I'm going to go ahead and give it some more water so I'm just going to read off the instruction that is on here for planting tulips this is my first experience buying tulips to plant so it says planting plant these bulbs in fall and if you cannot plant your bulbs right after right away store them in cool dry dark location like a basement plant them with the pointy end in a sunny or semi-shaded area about 10 to 15 centimeters which is four to six inches deep and 10 centimeters which is four inch apart water thoroughly after planting growing plant bulbs with different bloom sorry Plant bulbs with different bloom times together for an ongoing show of colors. These bulbs do best in loose, well-drained soil. Plant the taller varieties somewhat out of the wind due to their height. These bulbs are suitable for almost every possible application. Fields, beds, containers, borders, rock, rock gardens, as cut flowers and for forcing I'm not sure what forcing is taking care if you have problem with deer spray the bulb with deep repellent when the bulbs are five centimeters which is two inches out of the ground and when the flower bulb is visible Fertilize your tulip just before blooming with slow release fertilizer for the best chance to bloom again next year. Remove the flowers when they are spent. Winterizing. After flowering, the leaves should be allowed to die down. The leaves will gather sunlight and provide nourishment for next year's show. Tulips require a period of cold weather while they are dormant and resting between shows. Most tulips should be treated as annuals. Some Fosterian, Fosteriana, Gregi, or Gregi, and species tulips are suitable for naturalizing. Not sure what that means. Never heard the expression before. Anyway, that is the instruction that was given on the label. So, did you find this video informative? Would you like to see more videos like these? Why not take a moment to like, share, and subscribe to my channel so that you can and turn on your notifications so that you can get more updates like these. Thank you for watching. Have yourself a wonderful day.